Okay, the squirrel's there. It's under the tree. Just hiding in plain sight. I will bring, bring the gun. Cock it. Hope it doesn't notice me. Gun's cocked. Okay, safety is on. Back onto the stand. Okay, hopefully the squirrel's still there. Is it still there? Okay, it's still there. Okay, this little guy's still there. Perfect. Let's see if I can open up the window without being noticed. Oh, it's moving. It's moving fast. You hear me moving the window. It's gone. It's a gunner. So at this point, I need to cover up more. I went to Amazon and uh, looking for a drop cloth that is camouflaged, a hat, and uh, maybe a jacket. And that's what I found. I'm going to make a camouflage system here so the squirrel won't see me. So I'll put it right here. i do a triangle right here, cover the tablecloth, cover the chair. Okay, so I covered the window. There's two layers here. Okay, and it's easy for me to reach down and close and open the window without being noticed too much. That's the biggest thing is how not to get noticed when I stand in there, open and close the window, see the squirrel. I leave a hole here, try out the camera. Should have a pretty good shot all the way around. I should cover up this next and the table see how it goes I grab a bunch of this double fold in especially from the front it's uh, fairly interesting and I fluff this up and intertwine few of this so it look like it's actually a uh, falling leaf and brush and sit on top of it. And we, if you look from the front, it's very hard to tell what is happening. So now, as for squirrel, before it was a giant window, now there's only this much is visible. And I got one of these hats. For like 10 bucks. You look out of it, and when you wear it, it's easy to put it on, just just throw it on very quickly. And uh, yeah. no, no. that's what it looked like if I did camouflage. And I gotta do that wall right here. So at least from that angle, it's harder to see what's happening. I think the rest of the table, this is fine. That's all blocked. The chance of anyone see the rest of this table is very slim. I believe I finished. Uh, let's walk through this. Okay, they all held by a little pin. Okay. So I double layer this piece, so it's harder for it to see me open the window, and I can access from the bottom, scroll the window over. Okay. And I made a little bush in the front with my recycle cooler. And I have this hat with a mask over it, so they won't see me. And this is to cover my body with. Okay. And the chair, basically I just laying one on the back, so it's hard to see what's happening there. There's still a fold out here, but I think that's, that variation is okay. I was thinking to drape down a backdrop here to there. I can still do it using the chair, drape it down a backdrop, so when I open the door, it doesn't disturb too much. Maybe I'll try that, let me try. Okay, I like this better, because from the view, viewpoint, up there with this camel piece it's harder to see when I open the door typically that's when you scare the squirrel away 
It's harder for you to see. In the backdrop. So at this point, I'm going to try it on. I do aware how stupid I look. Especially sitting in the house. I really like how this turns out. The drop. Quad. So it's 26 feet total you're looking at. Okay. 1.5 meters wide. But I'd rather get more than I need it. End up to be perfect. I could use a few more feet, but it's okay. I mean, I could go all the way down to the ground, I guess. It's good enough. Blocks out the entire view. So 